You know, it's funny how we often take our bodies for granted, right? We wake up each morning, stretch a little, maybe grab a cup of coffee, and we just go about our day. We don't really think about what it means to be physically healthy until something goes wrong. It's like we're cruising through life through life in a car with a full tank of gas, not realizing that we should be checking the oil, the tires, the brakes. We're so focused on the destination that we forget to appreciate the vehicle that's getting us there. Physical health isn't just about looking good and good in a swimsuit or fitting into those jeans from five years ago. It's about feeling good, having energy, being able to play with your kids or grandkids without getting winded after five minutes. It's about waking up in the morning and not feeling like you've been hit by a truck. It's about being able to climb a flight of stairs without feeling like you need to sit down and catch your breath. It's about the little things that we often overlook. Think about it. Our bodies are incredible machines. They work tirelessly for us, day in and day out. They fight off infections, heal wounds, and adapt to the stresses we put them through. But they need our help. They need us to fuel them with good food, to move them, to challenge them. When we neglect our physical health, we're not just risking our bodies, we're risking our lives. Chronic diseases, obesity, heart problems, diabetes, they don't just appear out of nowhere. They're the result of years of neglect, of ignoring the signs that our bodies are sending us. And it's not just about the physical aspect. There's a mental component to it too. When you feel good physically, it affects your mood, your outlook on life. Exercise releases endorphins, those little chemicals that make us feel happy. When you're active, you're not just improving your body, you're improving your mind. You're reducing stress, anxiety, and depression. You're boosting your confidence. It's like a ripple effect. You take care of your body, and suddenly everything else starts to fall into place. You're more productive at work, you're more present with your family, you're more engaged in your life. But let's be real for a second. It's not always easy. Life gets busy. We have jobs, responsibilities, obligations. It's so easy to fall into the trap of convenience, grabbing fast food on the way home, skipping the gym because we're too tired. We convince ourselves that we'll start tomorrow, next week, next month. But tomorrow turns into next week, and next week turns into next month. And before we know it, we've let years slip by. I get it. I've been there. I've had those moments where I look in the mirror and think, how did I let it get this far? It's a wake-up call, and it's uncomfortable. But that discomfort can be a catalyst for change. It can push us to take that first step, to make that first healthy choice. It's about progress, not perfection. It's about making small changes that lead to big results over time. So, let's commit to being better. Let's prioritize our physical health. Let's move our bodies, nourish them with good food, and listen to what they're telling us. Let's make time for ourselves, even when life gets hectic. Because at the end of the day, our health is our greatest asset. It's what allows us to live fully, to experience joy, to connect with others. It's what gives us the strength to face whatever life throws our way. And that, my friends, is something worth fighting for.